Hi, this is a video to help you answer the question, how does changing the type of material affect the loudness of the sound? So what I'm changing here, my independent variable is the type of material. What I'm measuring, my dependent variable is the loudness of the sound. Okay, so we're gonna find out which material muffles the sound the best. Uh, <clears throat> firstly, you need something to make the sound. Um, that could be anything. Uh, I've just got this from the kitchen. That works. Uh, I got this from the kitchen as well, and I just put a pen top in there. That makes the sound, perfect, okay? So then we need to record the level of the sound. So you need to go to your science journal app on your phone or your tablet. Okay, click it. Click the plus button. Okay, you could give your own experiment a name, but it's not really essential here, okay? So we wanna be clicking on the little ball here. Okay, and then we wanna get on the right sensor. So we move along right to the end where there's a loudspeaker. You should be able to see that fairly clearly there. Click the loudspeaker. And then you can see um, it's recording the sound level in decibels. It's going up and down with my voice, okay? So record the sound level in an actual one point. We can actually just press the button by the side here, okay? So I click that button, just click it. You see it's actually recorded the level there, okay? So now time to do the experiment, okay? Keep the same. So control variables, how hard you shake it. Same every time. Keep the same distance of the sensor away from uh, whatever you're shaking, okay? You could use a ruler here. All right, so I'm gonna shake it, and I'm gonna record down the sound. I'm gonna press the button to record the sound. So shake it. Okay, record that down. 44.9. So you write down no material, that's what we call in science of control. Uh, now it's time to add our materials. We're going to add our change variables. Okay, so you could use different things from around your home. So I'm going to get a dishcloth here, wrap it around, and then do my experiment again. Remember, press that button, uh, shake it the same strength and the same distance. Okay. All right, so that one was slightly lower, 44.9. Okay, and I'd write that down. I'd write cloth on my table, and I would write 44.9 decibels. And then you could think about some different things around your house that you might want to test. So you could get some kitchen roll, other things, uh, newspaper, some aluminium foil, regular paper, um, a towel, up to you. Um, they won't all be the same thickness, but you could leave, you just need one layer on each one, okay? Uh, and that's the experiment. And once you've finished all those, uh, then you can go on to create a bar graph of your results and analyze your results.